Watch the full length and uncut version of this reaction on our Patreon for a dollar pledge. The link to our Patreon is in the description. Welcome, Welcome back, back to the Cruise Brothers, Brothers React Boruto, man. We're here for it. Uh, in the preview for last episode, uh, it looks like we're going to get Kawaki's backstory. I heard it was sad. People cried. This shit is serious, bro. What? Yes, you've been hearing spoilers? No spoilers, bro. I've been seeing like YouTube titles and shit. You spoiled it. <laughs> YouTube thumbnails. You just spoiled me, man. You're an idiot, bro. It's 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 his backstory. <laughs> Damn. Yo, did the animation go up? This should look crisp. What the fuck? Yo, oh, this is time, yo. It's a different anime. <laughs> Damn, we're getting a lot of backstory here. I don't think we ever got this. Yo, shut up, man. You don't, you don't know what this is right now. You never saw this anime. I don't think we have seen this yet. Oh, shit. Shut the fuck up, bro. Exclusive. <laughs> Stop talking shit. <clears throat> Just chop on wood. <clears throat> it's the hard life, man. This is interesting, man. I can't. I'm excited to see this shit. Let me see how we ended up. Mm, he's poor. We're doing jobs and shit. Damn, he gave him wood, that little bit of money for wood, and he's at the liquor store. Wait, is he? His dad just made him get him a bottle. Oh, fuck. That's fucked up <laughs> already. This is fucked up. Man did a job for money yeah, just to this buy is his father. Though. I like this man because we're actually Alcohol, getting yo. like more. Yeah, detail. we never we never got this, by the way, guys. We knew this his is... his his child was fucked up, but we didn't know how fucked up it was. This is definitely not in the manga. This is fucking interesting. The fuck was that about? Why you small? To go give him a free goldfish. <laughs> I'd be happy as hell, man. If I'm broke, I never had nothing to do. And then there's something free to do like that. And my life sucks. Gonna, you think his dad's gonna let him go, though? I don't know. Oh, uh, yeah. It's fucked up. I can see this shit. This motherfucker locks That's the crazy. cabinets of food. Uh -huh. おそもろは信じるな。俺の言うことだけ信じてればいいんだ。お前のために言ってやってるんだぞ。はい。俺の言うことを守らなかったバズだ。てめえ、今夜は飯の時だ。え。とっとと寝ろ。おやすみなさい
fucking Delta's fishy ass. Oh, they've been the work. They've been in the yeah, works so for Delta, a while. So Delta was the one who recruited Kawaki, huh? Oh, he's Jigen. Remember well, the I mean, flashback? Not, but he was the one who found the blood. Jigen would have not known about him if it weren't for her. It wasn't even his fault that that should happen. Now he has to go two days without eating. Not even eating. Not, look where the fuck he is now. Come on, man. They're gonna fucking. Oh, come on, man. This is fucked up, bro. This is major character development for. Your, uh, the way they're doing this is just mad cool. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh. There he is. Oh, shit. This motherfucker is scary. Jigen is this kid's savior right now, bro. No, it's. He's. According. For him, right now. てめえはもうこの家の人間じゃねえ。ということ、ここは僕の家でしょ。いさせてお父さん。聞こえなかったのか。てめえはもうこの家のガキじゃねえんだよ。そんなの嫌だよ。元いい子にするから、元々稼
Not talking to Toad, saying all this shit, and like he's literally he's sending him to his death right now. Him hard and obviously, fuck. but just think about it this way: he knows that he's sending him to his death, and look at what he's saying to him. <laughs> Imagine being this kid, bro. And then we wonder why he acts the way he acts right now. That creepy art style they do when they like. Oh my god, man! And then imagine trying to look at look Naruto. At the, look at that transition, bro. <laughs> These motherfuckers are cool. <laughs> this is a safe place. No! Oh my god! Imagine having to try and trust people after all this shit that this kid has been through. Man, that was such a good episode. <laughs> Naruto that's, of all. That's how you do the backstory in the, right? In the, in the fact we know we know so much about Naruto, bro. It's it's so cool, like I don't know, it's seeing that, that situation and that scene. <laughs> like, oh yeah, that's Naruto, bro. You really don't have nothing to worry about. It's fucking that was, Naruto. That was crazy, bro. Yeah, because like if you're watching it for the first long time, you know, you see that how um that now now you see a, a better insight on how Kawaki was brought up and why he doesn't trust anybody and the oh, why he is the way he is. Um and you know, <clears throat> like it's obviously not gonna be a day one trusting with Kawaki here, bro. Like he's gonna fucking doubt these freaking people that we know as come to know and love For as real? the fucking Leaf Village, years, the Konoha, years, Konoha Ninja, the Righteous Ninja. <laughs> Motherfuckers never did nothing wrong. I never <laughs> seen nobody in the Leaf Village do nothing wrong, <laughs> except for Itachi. <laughs> Yo, there's plenty of people in the Leaf Village who did something Sorry, wrong, I'm bro. Just kidding. Fucking Danzo, <laughs> I know, fucking. I know. <laughs> You know, That's all those funny. motherfuckers. Nah, but, you know, you can't trust, it. like like his dad told him, it was, it was true, bro. You really can't trust people because in the end of the day, that was a lesson that his dad taught him. And he still, to this day, keeps that lesson with him because he still doesn't trust anybody because look who he was sold to. Another person you can't yeah. trust. So, oh, shit, wait, wait, wait. Holy shit, bro. Preview time. <laughs> Yo, this is. Damn, he's about to go live with Boro. Wow, oh, man. Bro, the shit is happening, bro. Ah, shit is fuck, happening. Yo, that was such a good episode. Holy it shit. It was, bro. They fucking did a. F like, I, 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 so if I if Okay, so I love the episode. Don't get me wrong. If I had to criticize one little thing. Here we go. <laughs> come on, you gotta, like, dissect a little bit. And, like, if there's anything that you don't like exactly, you should say it. I, I, I at times felt like, um, you know, the sad story of Kawaki and his dad felt a little bit like forced or cliche in some areas. A little bit, I felt that way a little bit. Bro, but the was, okay, but but the way that they did it, the way that they told the story, the thing with the the fishes too, the way he imagined that, bro, as an escape. I mean, Come they, on, man. They added some good. They added some good stuff. Um, Asshole, just freaking uh, to the episode, yeah, especially with the goldfish. You know, like that being um, the one. Um, it was the it, one good memory the kid could hold on to through, during the, these hard times. Bro, it like was that. it was such a cool visual visualization of him yeah. trying to escape. Like seriously, that's fucking crazy, man. Like I like that. That's yeah, some. That. That that's definitely cool. That's some crazy trauma this kid has been through. Um, it's fucking probably relatable for a lot of people, man. Fucking relatable. Yeah. So man. it's crazy though, it's seeing how the Kara um actually really went around villages, like actually like going taking blood samples from random orphans <sighs> just to see who was compatible, and then they would take all these pretty much kidnap all these random kids. Yeah. Like I mean, you, what's weird? Oh uh, yeah, I mean it's not weird to me, like. I know, I guess, at first glance, it is kind of weird to think why Jigen wouldn't just kill the parents and take the kids. Yeah, um, yeah. But, no, yeah, it I, makes I, sense yeah, that yeah, you know. wouldn't want, they wouldn't want them to be... How else did they hide for so exactly, long? Exactly, how you know? did they be under the radar for <clears throat> so long, you know? These motherfuckers got money, so they're going to do it right. Uh, so, <laughs> yeah. So, it was just cool to see that, like, you know, the Kara freaking going through these steps. And, uh... Yeah, man, I, I'm I'm super interested to see next next episode and um the the interaction and the the talk that we're gonna see from Boruto yeah, Kawaki man. for the first time face to face. Fucking hell! You know you it's know it's gonna be like, good, bro, because Boruto's about to spit some wisdom on this kid, bro. He's yeah, gonna be like, yeah. I know how you feel, bro. <laughs> like I was alone, man. I ain't had no one, son. Listen, 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 listen. <laughs> I, I, there's one more thing I want to comment on is the contrast between those two scenes when uh. 
fucking Jigen said all that stuff to him. He's like, oh, this is a safe play, you know? And then Naruto says the same thing, bro. It's so, it's so, like, it's so well written, bro. Like, it's mad cool. I like it. Yeah, the transition was really good. Damn, and I, I have to reiterate this. We did not get 90% of the shit in in that flashback in the manga. Yeah, so this, this was good was anime only shit, bro. Anime canon good shit. Hell yeah. So, Fucking, you know. Damn. That, and just seeing them do like this little bit right here uh, that well, um, giving us that extra details for that, it just makes me uh, excited for all the other stuff that we might get extra details about. Um, that we for never real, fucking yeah. seen. You that's know? that's what there's a lot of things for. that were like you know glanced over in the manga because the manga was literally scene to scene, like action. action yes, action, there action, there action. are some people who have a problem with how certain things paced out in the manga. So yeah. if we get more details added, especially like this, I, it's gonna be it's gonna be perfect for me, bro. This will be per- I'm gonna love this fucking show. It's gonna be a good <laughs> arc, man. It's yeah, definitely man. gonna be a good arc. But yeah, like guys, said, you already know what time it is. Guys, thanks for watching. Again, you can watch these reactions in full length on our Patreon for a dollar pledge. Uh, go show some support. The more you support, the more we'll be able to pump out these videos every day and keep going. We appreciate every one of you. We appreciate everyone who's uh, pledged to the Patreon and all of you who are watching right now also. Take care of yourselves as always, and we'll see you in the next sports episode. Peace.